If there's one thing more difficult than starting a business, it's making sure it stays successful. And that's the hope for the newest Wichita Falls restaurant getting ready to serve up some hungry Texomans. I know I am ready for this. So Nick Clark joins us from Crawdaddies. Nick, they're doing some test runs tonight, right? That's right. The people that are here right now are here by invitation only. But when business officially gets underway next week, Restaurant staff are confident the business that's going to start coming here, well, it'll be coming long after the doors open for the very first time. The anticipation is high. I won't go about one lobster bit. Crawdaddy's executive chef Harvey Miller knows his way around the kitchen. The native Wichita spent several years at the Wichita Falls Country Club. But growing up, Miller says he was surrounded by women in the kitchen and never thought about a cooking career until one day when he saw his grandfather doing the cooking. I remember calling a cousin of mine uh, and saying, hey, we got a, um, we got pops is in the kitchen cooking and it's good. It was that experience that led Miller to become a student of food. That passion is something one of Crawdaddy's co-owners knows will come through via the food as well as the atmosphere. We put you in a place that you want to be. It's just a really soothing atmosphere. The service. We we'll give you a maiden voyage. But as recent history shows, not all maiden voyages, meaning Wichita Falls restaurants, stay afloat. However, Miller believes Crawdaddies will be sticking around, and for one of many reasons. Consistency. I'll make it happen. That's all I know how to do is make it happen. Hoping to catch as many Cajun seafood customers as possible. And those potential customers wanting to taste the food for the very first time will have their opportunity to do so Monday, bright and early at 11 a.m. Nick, they better hook you up with some food over there. Tell them to get you some lobster bisque, okay? Just a couple more days. All right, thank you so much, Nick. Stay